Hi there! If you don't know me, I'm Katrina Schaefer, one of the faces behind Schaefer Golden Doodles, and I wanted to give you a tour of the puppy's environment today. Now, for the first three weeks of um, their lives, the puppies stay in the house with us. Um, they're just in a little baby pool, and that's so that Mama is comfortable because she spends pretty much 24-7 nursing them, laying with them. Um, it's also for the puppy's sake because our home is a temperature controlled environment with not any fluctuation in temperature and they are not able to regulate their body heat yet um, at that point. And it's also easier for us because um, when they're really young, we are weighing them all the time, changing out their bedding and all of that good stuff. Um, so for the first three weeks, they're inside, but um, what we noticed was that once they can walk, um, they have a natural urge to uh, go to the bathroom away from where they're sleeping. So we really want to um, take that opportunity and give them early potty training from the earliest week possible that they have that urge. Um, and also we noticed that they want to have a lot of space and they want to start playing when they're able to really walk around. Um, so they really love to be outside with each other and we want to make that possible um, as much as we can while still giving them comfort. So um, you'll see what I'm talking about in just a minute. So this shed is right outside our house. I literally just walked out of our sunroom and ta-da! Here is our doggy house. So I am inside the dog house right now and if you hear a little bit of a hum, that's because there is an AC unit blowing cold air in here. We also have a fan going. So even though it is like a 95 degree day outside, um, it feels very comfortable in here, fully insulated and um, very cool. So um, this is the puppy area over here. Um, if you notice, we have some pine shavings over here. That is because how it is set up at the moment is for the puppies to not have access to the outside. So this wall would block them from getting to the outside. And we want to encourage them to go potty in a specific place because that is um, early potty training for them. So um, the pine shavings are supposed to attract them to going potty over there. And then when we want the puppies to have access to the outside, all we have to do is push this wall right here back so that it's flush with our dog house wall. Um, and then that will reveal this doggy door right here that leads to the outside. Um, so mom will always have access to go in and out through this door and um, this wall is tall enough that she can just hop over to have access to the puppies, but um, they will not be able to climb over this wall. Um, so we can control when the puppies are outside and when they're inside. Um, and even when this wall is flush with the back wall over here, they still have the choice then um, if they have access to the outside, they can come back inside to be in the AC if it gets too hot outside. So um, a lot of opportunity for them to be comfortable and to have the choice where they would like to be. Um, and last thing I want to show off in here is our Hall of Fame. This is our um, dogs from the April 2020 litter. Let me put their pictures up over here. Well, thank you so much for going on my tour with me. And last thing I have to add is that my husband, Trevor, is amazing and he made that doggy house possible. He ran the power out to the shed and installed the AC unit and all the insulation and everything. I just did some of the decorating. He did all the dirty work and um, it's going to be 
an awesome place for our puppies thanks to him. So uh, shout out to him and thanks for joining me. Bye.